Oh yeah, it's Friday. It's time for Pazak, and I'm trying to find keys that work. You're gonna have to deal with me, Karth. Did I mention that I'm recovering Pazak addict? I'm trying to get a good scan on his butt. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. Look at that. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I saw you're getting a Pazak lesson from that old fossil Garuk. Learning the rules of Pazak is easy. But actually playing the game is a much greater challenge. Normally, I wouldn't bother with a novice like you. But since Gerud was banned for hustling cards, I haven't been able to find a good game around here. Do you wish to play him? Let's play. I'm going to enjoy relieving you of your credits almost as much as I'm going to enjoy humiliating you. <laughs> How much do you want to wager? Is there a minimum wager? Let's wager 10. What? In my deck! Sure you want to use a side deck? That's all my cards! Okay. See, it's not the playing that's difficult, it's the winning that's difficult. I will always be impressed if I kick this guy's ass. No! God damn it! I will beat him. I will, I will, I swears. Oh yeah, enter. So how are you guys doing? Ow, oh, fucking figures. This guy's dealing from the bottom of the deck, I swears. Well, I gotta keep hitting end turn. Oh, you motherfucker! He pulls out his negative cards. That's what I'm looking for, is those negative cards. You can only get them with the... Mud six! Oh, you motherfucker! Pazak is not for everyone. It requires both nerve and skill. Perhaps you should practice before risking your credits against such a skilled player as myself. <laughs> Unless you like losing. Let's play. I'm going to enjoy. Shut up. Yep. Yes! We're gonna do it this time. Come on. The decision is whether to burn my cards soon. I can play a four and get 20 and beat him. Let's do it. Okay, we need two more wins. We can do it. You with me, guys? all my cards. I'm saving them. Oh, you motherfucker. This guy's a prick. I'm sure Karth is enjoying himself. <laughs> He's being my mom. He's like sitting on my lap. Oh, come on! You fucker! I knew he would pull out a negative card, the asshole! Dipshit. I hate it. <gasps> One more. One more, bitches. Woo. That was lucky. I figured he would pull a negative card out. I really did. Oh, God. All right. Should we risk it for the biscuit? So we have 15. We have a 5. That'll give us 20, and then we'll be done. Yeah. 
Come on, come on, come on! <gasps> we won! We won! Okay, everybody, everybody! Pause the video and do a celebration dance! Yeah, yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! You were lucky to win the last match. But luck is no substitute for skill in Pazak. If you are foolish enough to play me again, I won't repeat the mistake of underestimating you. Oh, you're gonna cheat those fucking cards, bitch? I don't think so. Now it's time to talk. Questions? <laughs> I don't come here to answer questions. If you want to play Pazak, then let's play. If not, then quit crowding my gambling table. Fuck you. If you ever wish to test yourself against the best Pazak player on Taris, <laughs> You know where to find me. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I just beat the best Pazak player in Taurus. That means I'm the best Pazak player in Taurus. My recovery is going quite well. I'll be back when I've got some negative cards, bitch. Shitball. Can we get closer to you? Oh, that's right. I want to see Karth's butt. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah. But it's nice and firm, too. Like uh, football players, you know? Or wrestler. All right. All right, all right, all right. Card, stop looking at me like that. I'm, I'm a good person. Oh, that presses the... I'm used to that each job. All right, come on. Let's go in the bar. Jesus. God, get away. Well, that went better than expected. Um, you have a name. Let's talk to you. Sorry, but I'm not here looking for conversation. I just came to get a drink, listen to some music, and try to relax before my next shift at the military base. Really? I don't wear my uniform when I'm off duty. It's not allowed. In fact, anyone in uniform is banned from entering the cantina. The officers don't even like it when we show up here off duty. Don't like us fraternizing with the locals, I guess. But it gets pretty stale hanging around the base all the time. Besides, the Sith don't own me. Being a soldier in their fleet is just a job, you know. A job with long hours and low pay, I might add. Sounds like you aren't very happy. When I signed up, I was promised adventure and excitement in exotic locales. Instead, I end up stationed at a military base on some backwater planet on the fringes of the galaxy. If I could just find some other way to earn some credits, I could give this lousy job up. Retire my uniform, so to speak. Can I ask some questions? The senior officers don't really like it when we start answering questions, you know? They don't want us fraternizing with the locals. Just another perk of the job. No offense, but I probably shouldn't be talking to you anymore. I'm just going to say something that might get me in trouble. Okay. I, I, I accept and understand that. Any more named people we can speak to? Anybody in here got a name? Where did you get those clothes? A trash compactor in the lower city? And where are those drinks we ordered? Uh, I don't have any clue what you're talking about. What you say. I get the feeling this spoiled brat could cause us more trouble than she's worth. Why is the help here so incompetent? One word from Daddy and I could get you fired. I should have saved. I'm sorry. That's better. Now, hurry up with our order. And here are your drinks, Miss Lavin. I apologize for the delay. <laughs> what? No tip? Cheap bitch. All right. Well, we got to find some way to make money. I really don't want to fight. It just seems so chop chop. Star killer. Remember him, kids? Leave me alone. 
I'm not giving out any auto prints to my fans today. Okay. Off with you then. I'm done with this conversation anyway. Wow, I looked up to you, Bendak. And now I know that you're such a prick. I'm gonna burn all my Bendak Starkiller figurines and pictures and auto prints <clears throat> and dildos. Christia, somebody's got a nasty cough. I saw your match against Niklos. He doesn't lose very often. I bet you could make a lot of credits as a professional Pazak player. Well, thank you, but I've already got them all. His name's Karth. He's right there. Don't tell him that, though. He's so cute. He's adorable. Oh. Yes, talk? what's on your mind? Think about this Karis? place? The planet's all one big city, but its golden years are long past. And things have gotten worse since the Sith occupied it. From what I hear, the wealthy live on the tops of all the tall towers, and if you're poor, you live down in the shadows. And it gets worse the lower you go. Well, that's all I can think of, at any rate. Okie doke. You got it. Oh. Maybe we could have another conversation. Whoa. Dude! Your, your, big, your big butt's in the way. Alright. Hey, man. Well, now what? Oops. I expected to play for a lot longer. I was actually just going to play uh, Pazak until I won. Is that just debris? Did you, did you see that shit flying around over there? Pause and L for log. The Rackles here. I really, I hate seeing this quest. It's so blah. Search for Bastila. Reports of escape pods that crashed into the Undercity. Okay. Okay. <gasps> <That's act back. gasps> All right. So, so now what? <clears throat> I don't know what to do. I probably should have looked at a walkthrough. Oops. Hey. Greetings and good day. On behalf of the new Sith rulers, I am programmed to encourage you to enjoy your stay on Taurus. I am a cryptical droid programmed to provide information to everyone on Taurus, citizens and visitors alike. Is there something I can do to serve you? Mm. I guess let's just ask him all, what can you tell me about the Sith? The Sith are the new authority here on Taris. They seek to preserve the customs of our world, or so I am told. More than this I cannot say. May I be of any further service to you? Mm-hmm. Uh, is there some way to get off this planet? I am afraid that is impossible. Taris is currently under a planet-wide quarantine. The Sith are allowing no one to arrive or leave, except on official Sith business. May I be of any further service to you? Uh, anything about the lower... Ugh. About the gags in the lower city. The Taurus Tourism Board has issued a strong warning to all visitors to avoid the lower city. It is a violent and dangerous place you would do well to avoid. May I be of any further service to you? Uh, aliens? Alien species have restricted access to the upper city. This is one of the most ancient traditions of Taurus, and the Sith have promised to preserve such traditions. Of course, <coughs> I have yet to see them arrest a single alien for traveling the upper city without a permit. May I be of any further service to you? Uh, who do you work for? I am an employee of the Taurus government, programmed to provide information and guidance to any who require it. May I be of any further service to you? Uh, 
no, that's then cool. if you will excuse me, I must continue my appointed rounds. Yep, and then we're shuffling, shuffling, shuffling. Well. Upper City North. Save. Uh, da, 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 da. Open door. Yep. All right. Gavik says you missed your last payment. Here, I I've got fifty credits. A down payment. That should buy me some time, right? Sorry, you're out of time. Now it's all or nothing. Davik can't have people not paying his debts. But I don't have that much. How can I give you credits I don't have? No, help! Somebody help! They're going to kill me! I know we have to be careful about drawing attention to ourselves, but... Are we gonna just let them drag this guy off? Hold on a second. Looks like we got ourselves a witness here. God, it sounds so cheesy, but having been in that situation, you can just fuck right off. What are you gonna do? Throw a concussion grenade at me? No! Alright, go! Light side points gained! Oh yeah! Ha! How'd you like that? I owe you my life! Those bounty hunters are going to take me away and kill me! My wife warned me not to take a loan from Davik. Now I can't pay him back! It's not good to owe a crime lord money! He'll just keep sending more bounty hunters after me till I'm dead! I can give you a place to hide! You already helped me by saving me from those bounty hunters, so unless you have a spare 100 credits to give me so I can pay off Davik, there's nothing else you can do. Damn, I spent all my money playing Pazak. <laughs> I'm getting out of here before any more of Davik's goons show up. You should do the same! Oh, we got more money. You know what that means. We can go play more Pazak. <gasps> what the hell? Oh my god. Get this guy off my screen. Alright, me. I gotta I got level up. Skills. Alright. Three, four, five. We're never gonna have any points to go cross close. Fuck it, that's cool. We created the following feat sneak attack, too. I may actually have to take some weapons. Mm. Mm, look at him stand. Oh yeah, badass. Um, hmm. Do we have any... don't have any armor for him, do we? Oh, oh well. <coughs> I leveled up. That was cool. What? Pause. Hmm. Oh. Uh, the Rackle Serum. Hmm. 
Well, we could talk to the guy about the Rackle stuff. See if we can get any. They're droids! They're fucking droids! They're flying. They're. Yeah! They're droids. Let's go talk to this guy. The good guy, not this prick. You get away from me, you butt much. Welcome back. Are you in need of healing? <sighs> the terrible affliction has played prolonged ex mm, There is no okay. the overran. If I could. I don't see how anyone could get their hands on that serum. The military base is crawling with Sith guards. Breaking in there would be a suicide mission. I suppose the Sith patrols in the Undercity might have a sample of the serum on them if they hadn't already used it because of a rat ghoul infection. But I doubt a patrol would just hand the serum over, and nobody is stupid enough to attack one of the Sith patrols, even in the Undercity. <clears throat> Please, don't say that! If the Sith hear you, they might think I'm suggesting you start attacking their patrols. They could shut me down. I only mentioned the serum because you asked. I don't actually expect anyone to get me the serum. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? No. Goodbye, and good health. I did that thinking maybe. That personnel only. Hmm. If I was evil, I would totally break in there. Go away! Well, I guess it's this place or nothing. Oh god, I had to go to the edge. Ugh. Well, let's go. Look at that droid. Look at him. Look at how he's walking. He's walking like... Not like he's got a full diaper, but like he's carrying a load of clothes or some shit. Okay. So we're up here. Something seems to be bothering Karth. The guy right behind him, he won't fuck off. Fuck off, dude. Yes, We're having a conversation. It's a good time to ask you more questions. I'm all ears, beautiful. Woohoo! Excuse me, I need to fan myself and calm down. Mm hmm. I should have did a save. I think I got the auto save. Well, I do want the romance, so it's not this, and it's not that, but it's like, do I want to go with, I like the sound of that, or why do I get the impression you're not serious? I would say this. We can always, I'm trying to have a romantic conversation here, stop putting in, like, hurry up. So I'll say this. Maybe I'm just avoiding your questions. Is this really necessary? Hmm. Now I want to go with the other one. <laughs> I just want to get to know you better. Oh, well, if it's an interrogation you wanted, why don't you say so? I'm going to reload. Hmm. Excellent. Soon all your secrets will be mine. I never said it was an interrogation. No, I was just joking. Though you do seem to be full of questions. It's rather refreshing, to be honest. Let me ask you something first, though. I've been going through the battle aboard the Endar Spire over and over in my head since we crashed. Uh -huh. Some things just don't add up for me. Maybe you could tell me what happened from your perspective. I wasn't in a position to know what the hell was going on. Neither was I, to tell the truth. I was on board as an advisor for the most part. The battle began so fast it's anyone's guess as to what actually happened. We lost the ship and a lot of good people. And, and for what? In the hope that the Jedi powers would save us somehow? Not that Bastila had much of an opportunity to act. We didn't choose that battle anyway. It got forced on us. Hell, I'm, I'm, I'm just as surprised that any of us are alive to talk about it. Come to think of it, it's more than a little surprising that you happen to be here, isn't it? 
I mean, just what is your position with the Republic fleet anyway? I can't. The long story is that I, I got addicted to playing Pazak and I ended up with a gambling problem. I still have it. And I, I owed some people some money and I ended up smuggling some stuff and then I got caught and then I was forced to work for the Republic and now we're here. A smuggler? I should have guessed. Isn't it odd, however, that a smuggler who was added to the crew at the last minute just happens to be alive? Maybe I got luck? You'd rather I wasn't? Don't be ridiculous. You've more than proved yourself since the crash. We wouldn't have made it this far without you, but still. No? Well, maybe. Don't get me wrong, it just seems odd that someone Bastila's party specifically requested to transfer aboard happens to survive. Why would she request my transfer? The Jedi requested numerous things when they came on board. I mean, hell, they practically took over the ship, as far as I could tell. Considering your connection to Bastila and the Jedi, whether you know it or not, your presence here seems a little convenient. I'm probably wrong, and this is probably nothing. I learned a long time ago not to take things at face value, ever, and I hate surprises. I, I had nothing to do with the crash. I expect you're right. I've got no real reason to suspect you of anything. Still, it's better to be safe than sorry, right? Are you always this suspicious? Look, it has nothing to do with you personally. I don't trust anyone, and I have my reasons. And no, I'm not going to discuss them, so can we just keep our mind on more important things? This is important. All right, all right. You must be the most damn persistent woman I've ever met. We'll <laughs> talk about it, but later. Right now, I just want to get going. Ooh. Mm. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to save, and I got to... I got to... I got to... I gotta go back. Do we have an autosave? No, we don't have an autosave. Oh my god. Oh wait, new slot. Um. Let's see, load. Let's load the autosave. Yes, I want to ask you the other questions. Maybe it'll take us down a different path. Oh, wait a minute. Is this where we were? Yeah. Wait a minute. Is this the right way? It has to be. Right? This is the right way, right? What? Oh. We were on the wrong side of the door. I feel like a tar ball. Let's see about talking over here private for a minute. Speak to Karth. Yes, what's on your mind? Is this a good time to ask you more questions? I'm all ears, beautiful. I like the sound of that. Which? The fact that I'm all ears, or the beautiful part? Damn! Now it's like, are you flirting with me, or the beautiful part? Keep calling me that. Yes, let's go with that one. I might consider it, but what are you going to call me in exchange? I would just go with handsome, about handsome thug. I like the first part of that. I'm a bit more partial to the most handsome pilot in the galaxy. Well, what do you think? I'll think about it. Well, then I guess gorgeous will just have to do until then, won't it? No, but kidding aside, I bet you're not about to give up on those questions of yours. <laughs> Are they really necessary? <laughs> I just want to get to know you better. Well, if it's an interrogation you wanted, why don't you say so? 
Excellent. Soon all your secrets will be mine. All my secrets are purely of the mundane variety, unfortunately. Nothing worth extracting, though you're welcome to try. Let me ask you something first, though. I've been going through the battle aboard the Endar Spire over and over a month. Okay. Some things just don't end up. All right. And I think the conversation's just gonna go like how we went, so. Neither was I to tell we lost the sh We didn't choose that, come to think of it. A smuggler. Don't be ridiculous. Yeah, I just had to say that. So I think this went a lot better than the other one. The Jedi requested numerous. Considering you're, I'm probably wrong. Hmm. What do you mean by surprise? I mean, I have to expect the unexpected, just to be safe. <clears throat> you know we're on the same side, right? Look, it has nothing to do with you, per and no, I'm not going to discuss them, so can we just keep our mind on more... All right, all right. You must be the most damn persistent woman I've ever met. We'll talk about it, but later. Right now, I just want to get going. I liked how that uh, that went a lot better, so... Let me save, and... Um... Yeah, I liked how that went better, so... We'll save over that. There we go. Have I paused? I've paused, okay. <clears throat> I think I've wasted enough time, actually, so... Let's get... Oh yeah, look at me just like that. Alright, so um, that's going to be it. I will see you on Monday when we will continue Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. I'll see you.